as an independent observer or somebody who was on the ground during that uh, election, uh, do you really think that uh, uh, President Yorim 7 won the election fair and square? Of course, um, I'm not in a position of making that judgment because, first of all, I was not in a position to count the votes, rather. But based on what I was able to see, and based on the interaction that I had with a lot of people, and there are very many, ordinary people who voted, those people of civil society who were monitoring the elections locally, and some of those international observer teams. Based on all that, to be very honest with you, I would say that if there is anybody who would have won that election, it would have to be opposition candidate, Colonel Dr. Chiza Besige, retired. On the other hand, no one to win outright in the first round. That probably could have been accepted. That probably nobody hit the magic number of 50 plus one vote. So that you could actually have had a second round. To be very honest with you, if we have an election that has been declared on the basis of facts, on the basis of documentation, let us have an international group that does the auditing, just like they did in Afghanistan, just like they did in Haiti. I challenge the Ugandan government to accept an international audit.